subject to a press release uh, issued by the Bono East Regional Co Police Command over the arrest of some five persons alleged to have uh, involved in uh, causing harm and damage at the NDC Regional Party Office. The Techiman Circuit Court, presided over by His Lordship Justice Malcolm Bejra Esquire, has granted bail to four of the five persons. One of them, referred to as A1, is however uh, detained and will be re reappearing before the court and the next court date. We've been speaking to the lead counsel for the suspects, lawyer Osu Adman, and he has been sharing with us what transpired at the courts today. The first case which involves four accused persons is about causing harm. The prosecution or the police are alleging that the four accused persons have caused harm to one Farahan, who according to them is now on admission at the Bono Regional Hospital in Sunyani. The child A1, the first accused, with the actual substantive offense of causing harm, then the three others were charged with conspiracy of causing harm together with the first accused. All of them pleaded not guilty, the four accused persons. Now with regard to the second offense, which is causing damage to the regional party headquarters of the NDC, in this Bono East region. There were 13 suspects or accused persons. 12 of them are at large. So it is only one person who has been arrested and was arraigned before court this morning. But he denied and therefore pleaded not guilty to the offense. We, the lawyers, put in an application for bail for him and the court saw reason with us to admit him to bail. Because bail doesn't mean the matter has ended. Lawyer Osu Ejman is a stalwart of the National Democratic Congress here in the region and he has been sending caution to the members of the party here in the region uh, to let sanity prevail as the party prepares to recapture power from the new patriotic party in the next general elections. There have been a series of, you know, mishaps. And I'm sure they will take a cue from this and stop. Because the party needs unity in order to recapture the Techiman South constituency parliamentary seat, which is the preserve of the NDC. They have no reason to engage in what they are doing. As it stands, the four persons who were granted bail, three of them were granted an 80,000 Ghana cities bail with two sureties and the other, who is the uh, constituency chairman of the NDC in the Chiman South, has also been granted a 50,000 Ghana cities bail with two sureties. All four, including the one currently under detention, will be reappearing before the court on Wednesday, the 3rd of August, for the proceedings to continue. From the Techiman Circuit Court for Joy News, I am Anna Sabit reporting.